I wasn't planning on making a video today, but my Tesla Model 3's FSD handled a complicated construction zone so expertly this evening, I just had to save the dash cam clips and share it with you all. Some overnight construction on a stretch of road that was being expanded from two lanes to four forced a one lane road situation, so we had to wait our turn to go then drive on the wrong side of the road for at least a half a mile. Okay, let's cut to the chase and watch how things play out as we get over to the wrong side of the road. There was plenty of time to move over, and each car on the line did so as they cared to. There was no orderly transition. I think the Tesla moved over once it saw the flag man standing in the middle of the lane. I've sped up this part of the video to four times speed, so watch it for the next 40 seconds or so, with FSD picking its way through the construction zone between the cones and the curb. I've owned my Model 3 for five and a half years and bought FSD at least a year before the beta test period started, so I've seen the evolution of this thing from more or less the beginning. I have to say that it's come a really long way. Making its way through this construction zone the way it is here never would have happened, say, a year or two ago. Okay, back to normal speed video. When it came time to move back over to the other side, there was a really wide and long stretch of road to do so and it wasn't particularly clear where the end of the transition was. But the car drove competently across the open space right over all the lines in the road that weren't helping at that point, and it got itself right where it needed to be. So there you have it. Like I said before, this sort of natural feeling maneuvering through a complicated situation shows that Tesla's full self-driving software really has come a long way. As always, I'm really looking forward to the next update to see what the next step in this evolution will look like.